What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be talking about the Ahsoka series, but before we do get into all of that, remember hit the subscribe, like, and notification bell so you're always in the know on everything Star Wars. Don't forget I have a membership program that I just did an update to, so make sure to join one of them as the tiers are simply amazing and I've updated them, so definitely go check them out so you get to get behind the scene footage and go live with me on my daily content. Go check out the merch store as I do have Eternal Sith merch that you definitely want to go check out. And as always, once you're done watching this video, go check out my last one give it a thumbs up as you watch let's start the show well, welcome to the show with the eternal self every visit banger best believe he don't mess do me a favor drop us up and keep tuning in if you like what you see go and share with your friends According to Ahsoka star Rosario Dawson, Filoni's background made working on this particular Star Wars TV show very unusual indeed. Now, speaking to The Hollywood Reporter before the strike did go on, she noted that Filoni has carried lessons from animation over into the live action series of the Ahsoka series. Now, Filoni's approach promises to result in some tremendously strong visuals, while many recent Star Wars TV shows have been criticized for their visuals, especially most recently of the Kenobi series. Now, mostly through, you know, overdependence of poor use of the volume as well. Now this technology allows directors and showrunners to create immersive CGI environments around their stars, but unfortunately it's led to the formalic shot composition to accommodate the technology. Now Disney's focus on the volume is entirely understandable. It's an effective cost saving measure, but it is really needing someone to carefully consider every shot in order to make the way the volume actually works. Now, thankfully, Filoni's style seems to lend itself perfectly to this. Now, Filoni is essentially blurring the lines between traditional animation and, you know, met methodologies and those employed in live action. Now, this is even more exciting considering he is now set to direct an upcoming live action Star Wars movie, one that spins out of Ahsoka and The Mandalorian, and it will be fascinating to see how this plays out with the visual effects of everything that we're supposed to be getting for not just the Ahsoka series but the Mandalorian movie as well and if Rosario Dawson is here talking about it in a sense of how the volume for the Ahsoka series is going to look so amazing I mean one can only assume and wonder you know the new heights that this show is going to bring to the Star Wars and Mandalorian and Lucasfilm era as we are entering something that is going to be big. I mean, it's not just the characters themselves, but it is like she said and talks about the visual background as well and everything that is going on, you know, during this time that we're going to see, especially with the unknown regions, I feel like it's going to be beautiful. It's going to be something out of this world as they have been talking about the series for the longest. And again, you know, with here Hearing how there's going to be this awesome dynamic with Ahsoka and Sabine and just hearing how we're getting thrown and this world between worlds, I feel like it's going to take us on an awesome and amazing adventure and ride that I cannot wait to endure and, you know, to start once August 23rd happens and comes for the Ahsoka series. But comment down below, guys. Is this something that really excites you guys in hearing, you know, how Rosario Dawson talks about Filoni's background and how he's really changing up the dynamic in the game when it comes to having unusual effects and really changing the game up as he's bringing everything that he did from anime now into live action with his character of Ahsoka and the rest of the Rebels crew and more. For more Star Wars content, hit that subscribe, like, and notification bell so you're always in the know as I'll have more content out tomorrow. Don't forget, I have a membership program. Definitely want to join. There's three tiers. I just updated them and I will be going live behind the scenes. So make sure to join the membership program so you could check on the community post for members only, the live stream link for that. And I will be talking about everything Star Wars and more in depth details. Thank you so much for tuning in guys don't forget the eternal sith then now forever later guys